I've titled my stream The God of Emoji Has Returned. I don't know if that's true, but I feel like I have been playing a little better in Super Auto Pets lately. Make sure we're on free to play for now. And I gotta tell you, I'm in, I'm in two different metas now in my life, okay? Meta one is, um, well, I'm, I'm skipping ants on occasion. No choice there, though. Um, will be the skilled hands. Meta one is we don't care what an animal does as much as we care uh, what its stats are. And meta two is AT&T. Always take turtle. Always take turtle. We'll take a mosquito. We'll take two fish. This one wants to buy you flowers. That's what I said now. This one wants to talk for hours. Now go ahead now. This is one of the worst teams I think I've ever seen. <laughs> no offense. <laughs> it's truly terrible. There was, as soon as I saw the animal composition, there was a 0% chance we were going to lose that. Okay. Now, we go up. AT&T, baby. Always take a turtle. Now, get pilled. That's totally fine. Turtle slots in nicely right there. Tell you what, give me one of these, and you know what? We're going to get freaky with it. Take a little dodo, even though it doesn't seem that important. AT&T AT is evil in this game. Dude, the, I'm just telling you, the reason I started playing AT&T meta is because I started encountering many AT&Ts myself. As a result, I felt like I had no choice. We don't sweat that loss yet, though. Okay. We, we skip. That's an insult, quite frankly. We skip again. We decide that a cricket is not long for this world. We hit you. No, thank you. Very cursed shops, without a doubt. But we take our stance where we can get them. Should I change my bet? I don't believe so. I don't believe so. We might lose. We're going to lose this round, but we're starting to get up, okay? The next step is... Like, I'm not sweating this in the slightest yet. The next step is definitely pilling the turtle. You want to win some rounds? Give me a garlic fish. Roll me. Buy me. Now we're freaking talking. Sell me. And then literally, I'm disrespecting the cricket that hard. That hard. Middle badger. It's quite an interesting situation you've got here. I don't know if I would invest in that, to be honest with you. The, the middle badger, I'm not sold on. Now, I'll be honest with you, I'm not totally sold on a dodo, but... For now, I think we could we could kind of finesse it. I'll take a mosquito up a level. And then you gotta go skunk. It's just that simple. The skunk fits on the team. Giraffe is slightly late. Slightly late. We don't sweat this. As soon as you blow out a kangaroo, you're beating the team. It's not even close. Now, you take another turtle. Sell me. I know what you're going to say. It seems like overkill. We don't pill it yet. Unless we find a better animal. That would be lovely. That would be lovely. Maybe we pill it next time. Okay. AT&T meta. We needed two swans to make this work, but I'm still feeling pretty solid. No, we lose this one. That's fine. It's a strong team. Are we on lethal? Yes. Okay, not even close to the believer threshold, but don't worry, because check this out. Level two skunk, and then a scaler. Please, Lord, I've never asked you for anything. You piece of crap! You snake! <laughs> Microbe! I'm not built for this! We win these. Okay, how do you build a microbe team that loses? Like, honestly, just... Like, what what happened? Why are you running microbe if you're not winning? It doesn't make any sense. I gotta be honest with you. The dodo has been very bad for us. It has to go. We will chocolate a seal. 
buy a cow, feed the seal, feed the seal. Don't really care for a level three mosquito. It's not part of my plan right now. Chocolate, a seal? You hate to see that, but what did I expect? Another skunk, another chocolate, okay. 810, you're kind of chilling, okay. The skunk's gonna be pretty pog. Maybe we just stick with the cow. That's good, that's why we take a skunk. That was genuine excitement. Nice fish, wow. Nice back to build. I gotta be honest, you gotta go level three skunk here. Probably the, the easiest shop you're ever gonna see in your life. We don't, it's too late for a buffalo IMO. We saved the targeted food. Level three swan, please. What we wanted to see was a squad that was a little less wide, but this is certainly, certainly interesting and certainly doable. Believers win. Sell a fish, buy a sushi. If that didn't hit, I was going to lose my mind. We're adding a tiger onto our skunk. I get we're sticking with the cow for the time being. Might put a scorpion in there eventually. That's for a seal. That's for uh, uh, freeze it. Why you got to do this to the believers? What are you talking about? We just won. It doesn't matter if you win by an inch or a mile. Nice blowfish. It does blow fish. <laughs> cat might be good. I'm not a I'm a cat guy IRL. I'm not a cat guy in game. Just being honest. Some situations, sure. I, I understand it. I see it. This situation, I don't know. I'm I'm happier as it stands, I think. I think with a level three skunk, we can compete with all scaling right now. It's not gonna be guaranteed. But I, I like this team, man. Love watching this on YouTube. Helps to teach our seven month old about the animals. It's true. Honestly, like I'm my daughter, whenever she sees super auto pets. She points at the screen and says, duck. I don't have the heart to tell her that it's probably the worst tier one animal in the game. It's very cute, though. It is very cute. Oh, what's this? Nine wins? Did I break it? <laughs> Why did I feed the tiger? Okay, well, look, that's a play I wouldn't expect you to understand. I was merely taking the tiger out of um, uh, uh, 10 HP damage range. This is one of the most important thresholds in the entire game. And the uber milk. 10,000 IQ. Ooh, 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 you hate to see it. Both of your good animals got killed and I didn't even have to use these guys. Well, okay, there's 10 wins. I told you I was back. What is the title? The God of Emoji is logged on. I told you. I told you. And what's the takeaway message? Turtles and skunks, baby. Turtles and skunks. We did have some luck in the shops. So I'll just be honest about that. But Did I run the casino again? I did. Okay, good news. Good news. Fine. Fine. Be the wet teapots. It's kind of like their ideal state, right? Was it the cheese ingot? I'm gonna say, I believe the ingot of cheese, it, it gave me the calcium I needed to pog up right now. Yes. And then, something people don't embrace. One of those. I'm telling if you're going to stick with an animal for a few rounds, buying an apple for that animal, I think it's a nice thing to do. Who says you're so lucky? You're so lucky. Fish me. No fish. That's fine. 
This is not a hedgehog build. I'm going to be honest. I want these ants out of here. I want them gone. As long as you don't hit the ants. Okay, we're going to do a play that I don't think the Jedi would teach you about, okay? It's called Cupcake Crab. I should have frozen the damn meat. Big place. Big place. Small place. <laughs> Cupcake me. Roll me. I'll tell you what. Feed me. Now we got a 311 crab out there. Time is not a one way street. So true. Crab is good, but you gotta use it as like a ballast. You can't use it as anything beyond ballast, okay? Now this is just a strong team. This is just a very strong team. Now we can start the pog. We're going to kill you. We're going to level. Not a great whale build, honestly. I think we're gonna garlic our fish. And we're, you're going to laugh at me. We're going to add a duck to the squad. Just a little flavor of the month so we can sell it next time. The other alternative there was buy nothing, I think, which also could have been a good play. But look at this. Look at this. Then we sell the duck. And i got to be honest, this is where you then go rabbit. And you sell the animals you don't care for, and we buy, and we buy, and then we roll for meat. I don't mind that, actually. I'll freeze the whole damn shop. We run a four squad, hoping we lose the round, hoping we lose the round, but honestly feeling like I might actually step away with the worst win of all time. I'm keeping them frozen, man. I'm keeping them frozen. We can buy foods instead. That's that's the whole purpose of us having the rabbits to begin with. Don't don't even mind it. Don't even mind it. Honestly, no, we can't can and buy three. Okay, kill me, kill me, please. Llama Sue build. I suppose, dude. This fish is doing insane amounts of work. I can't lose. I can't lose. Take some meat. I need targeted foods. I mean, it's very strange. Don't get me wrong, but... Go ahead, kill me. I'm gonna need a better class of criminal to show up in Super Auto Pets. Like... This is getting a little embarrassing. I'm telling I'm running it straight back. We have no problem selling a crab or an elephant to make our plan work. This is like the actual perfect uh, setup for us here. I'll be straight up with you once again. Just just hit the seal. Ah, oh, you're a piece of garbage. We lose this, we sell the crab. Probably. I'm a little scared though, I don't have a skunk as of yet. This is like, you should not let me win anymore. Now I do want a skunk, okay? But I, I can't keep you frozen. Maybe we'll just win fast instead. Oh no, my points, they're broken. Oh my god, something killed my fish? Finally! How could we be on lethal? We won like 10 games in a row. Oops. 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 Oh man. You should have seen your face. Oh man. Oh! What?
No! <laughs> All right, that's a stronger team built in the same mold. But you know what? That was fun. At least we got to use our snails. Paid out the believers. Look, there, we did it for the content. I know, you're like, I would never do that. Yeah, I know. Buffalo, buffalo, uh, monkey, monkey, monkey. Wow, so creative. You know. You know, there's something that, look, we prefer to have more crickets. Be the domesticated packages. Don't you... We're not living the the old horse meta where horses are bad. The horse build is actually the strongest build round one, two. I would I would just like honestly commission time at the NASA Jet Propulsion Laboratory in order to prove it. I I for real think that horse cricket is unbeatable, preferably more crickets than horses, but unbeatable. Unless two of your horses get sniped. Then it's a little beatable, but... But then Mosquito loses to everything else, man! Well, many other things, and many people are saying this. Um, okay, this might be certainly early enough for a swan. But I also do uh, love a rabbit, no question. I think, you, I think you just run it pretty much like, like this son of a gun right here. This is going to be a very strong potential scaling build. This is actually good. I know you're going to be like, it's not. I'm here to tell you it is. And you'll see for yourself. Immediately. Rabbit swan food. And then we pivot off the horses eventually. It's that easy. Feed me? Freeze me? Two, f two foods. It's actually like an insult what you're doing here. Like to not give me good foods is insulting. I'm rolling for salads, man. Just in case. Where's my damn salad, dude? That's literally like a war crime what they just did to me. Salad's not unlocked until round five. Congratulations. I uh, was testing you, and you passed. <laughs> Good thinking. Yes? Yes. Okay. Forget a buffalo. Buy me? Buy me. You know what? Buy me. Uh, eight, I'm telling you, AT&T is the strat for me. If it rhymes, how could it be wrong? If rhyming is wrong, I don't want to be right. Salad me. Even if the turtle gets it, I'm not sweating it. Buy me. I gotta be honest, actually, the pill's looking pretty sick. <laughs> I gotta be honest, the pill's looking pretty sick. And then for a second, we'll just toss you one of these. And then I'll be honest, we're looking to add another turtle to the squad as soon as possible. Honey badger. That's cute. Welcome to uh, uh, October meta. <laughs> oh, you killed me. Oh, no, my bee. It's broken. Sad. Pretty sad. That's pretty sad. You know what? That's sadding. You know what? That's pretty sad. I gotta be honest. I think you sell a horse and you go tortle in front of a hippo. Your swan's already doing great work. And then we look for some foods to feed this hippo. Order? No, no, I don't believe there is order. Diso how do you own disorder? Now somewhere between the rooster, the rooster, and the level two sheep. You know what I'm talking about? 
a lot of people don't listen to System of a Down. They're a little too hardcore for them. But I'm, I'm, I don't shy away from music that challenges me. That's why I listen to a lot of Imagine Dragons. Mm, a level three swan? You shouldn't have. <laughs> shouldn't, shouldn't have doubted. Probably. Yeah. Yeah, probably. I'm highly upset by that, but you know what? That just shows you the power of garlic. What's your favorite system of a down song? Wake Up is a good one. Wake up, wake underscore up dot mp3. Oops, oops. You're lucky. Chop suey? I haven't heard that one. Cricket. I don't think so. Ooh, sell a cricket, get a cow. Sell a cricket, get a cow. Feed the hippo. Take a quick little roll. Dude, honestly, the rabbit is like so good is kind of unfair. How do you have a level one rabbit on turn 10? Don't talk about team 10 to me, okay? I'm probably the biggest Paul brother Stan out there. So, like, if you want to step to me and think you know more about the Paul brothers than I do, you are sorely mistaken. Sorely. Marty McSorely mistaken. This team is going to freaking pop, man. Logan or Jake? I think I'm more of a Logan Paul guy. He made his mistakes when he was a little bit younger, not to excuse any of them. Um, but he seems to have shown a desire to mature as he's, as he's gotten older. I feel like Jake Paul is kind of addicted to the, from what I, the limited amount I know at least, he's addicted to that state of permanent adolescence. Um, Logan Paul seems to have, dare I suggest, some higher-minded ideals. I've spent a lot of time thinking about this. And many people are saying it. Who's your favorite Voros twin? I, I, I couldn't possibly choose. I, I'm offended you even asked, honestly. He's got too much HP. Do you see the HP? Nah, man. Nah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay. Some people will say order on this one, but like, how do you own disorder? Uh, or let's get rid of this. I wanted to see if we could do a little better. Honestly, do me a favor. Toss me a little snake in here. It's a little, that's a little bit of an ambitious snake, but I'm tossing it in there. Oh no, my snake. It's weak. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, let's go. Little scary. I mean, that round, it had, it had some spice. You gotta try. Forget a salad. A sushi I'll take. A sushi I'll take. Did you know on the last season of Orange is the New Black... Crazy Eyes was drafted into NASA's space program as an outreach for female convicts and went to outer space. You did not know that? All right, I made that up. I just thought it would be funny to, like, lie one time. <laughs> I didn't see how many people believed it. That did not happen. That did not happen at all. Oh, man. Get this snake out of here. It actually sucks. I believe this so hard. Oh, you should see your face, man. This. 
dude, come on. You have you ever seen the show? They can't say crazy eyes in outer space, man. She's she's not equipped for it yet. She hasn't done her time yet. That was just that would be funny though. It would be a, like a funny thing. Um, I don't know. You know what really hit the spot here? A slightly stronger turtle. That's true, because it's it's actually easier to teach convicts how to go to space than it is to teach astronauts how to go to prison. Well, this was still a good run. Honestly, I think we could do a, a, a turbo run. A turbo run. That was still nine wins. Well, actually, that one astronaut did disprove that, right? Because she did go to prison for peeping and pooing in her astronaut diapers on the way to threaten to kill her boyfriend's mistress. Anyway, here's a world record speed run. Here we go. Oh, no! Desperate bones. It's perfect. She did pee pee in her pampers. We draw these. Yeah, then, like, Noah Wiley, famous for uh, Fargo, made that, like, movie about her as played by Natalie Portman that was apparently, like, incredibly boring. Like, if you're gonna make a movie about my life and, like, you know, maybe there were crimes involved, at least make it exciting. Otherwise, it's, like, it's just a double whammy, right? Like, first, you, like, went to jail for threatening to kill somebody, but then also they made a movie about it, and the movie freaking sucked, dude. That's why, like, I, Tanya is so goaded. Oh, come on. We needed that one, man. No, we didn't! I, Tanya, it's a great movie. It's a fantastic film. Many people are saying this. Get pilled? I knew it. What the? <laughs> Imagine I, Tanya, but it's actually I, Robot. How would that work? It's interesting to think about. Certainly interesting to think about. We win these. Always roll a turtle. Honestly, Dodo, you had your chance. You blew it. Out of sight, out of mind. This is good. This is a smart thing that I'm doing here. Yeah, sure. Why not? Oh, yeah. You don't go on top of a hedgehog. So it's going to break my fish's melon armor, but then also it's going to set up another melon armor. Order? I don't know what I'm doing. I've lost my mind. <laughs> I've lost it. And I am reaping all the benefits. Okay, that's fair. You got me on that one. That's a gimme. That's a gimme? More hedgehogs, please? I'm telling you, I think that the, the turtle placement looks stupid. And is dumb, but is also right. Now, the data does not appear to be backing that up right here. Level 2 turtle. Ooh, this changes everything. Get this stinky swan out of here. No, be smarter. Look, I'm sorry, doubters. I know I gave you, like, some false hope for a second there. But, like, this is much better. Like, this is substantially more positive, for sure. We were doing something that was dumber than Bacta. I don't disagree. Penguin? I don't think so. This is how I win. Penguin blind? I don't think we'll be taking a penguin on this one. I think we'll be doing this. Two melon armor for the price of one. Honestly, toss me a little rhinoceros up at the front. Now, I don't know if this is going to work. 
But it's how. Don't think too hard. <laughs> Look, I want it to be known that we're taking a little bit of a lark on this one. Hold on. Oh, 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 oh. We're still pogging. Holy cow, look at this. Then a little scorpion up at the front to soften the blow. We're on the believer threshold. I'm one minute away from being on time. One minute and one second away from being late. That's the damn dream. So there's the believer threshold. Feed me. I can't believe it, man. Believe it or not, you son of a bitch, you're still going to burn. Take one of these. He's actually cracked. I'm just waiting until we, we hit a badger at the back with our crocodile. Oh, man. Ooh, my crocodile's stronger. <laughs> it's just that easy, man. I mean, we could have won up to Scorpion. That would have That would have been smart, but instead we'll just get Big Scorp. I'm telling you, Melon Armor is, is the meta right now. Melon Armor is too strong. It's too good. As you can see for yourself, by the way. We're on lethal. Okay, that's not a problem. Big Scorp. We love it. Take one of those. Actually, people think it's a meme. It's actually high value because of all the Melon Armor up, up at the front now. Now, it's not going to do much for us here, but... There will come a time, man. Her life is in your hands, dude. I know I'm a little late. I'm playing as fast as I can, okay? I know it's noon. We, we, we got a maximum of two more games. In all likelihood, we probably got one. So just shut up. Or are we pogging? I don't know. This is where the one-up benefits you. Oh, my scorpion. It broke you. All right. There you go. See, we're right on time. Slash marker. We're 